Hey everybody, I'm Meds, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man 64! In the last episode, we got absolutely nothing done. We just enhanced my... that, my Machine Buster, and got... and Mega Buster, really not much, I'm sorry for that. So, let's go through this tunnel. As you can see, this thing is much more powerful now, even just with that one enhancement. And, yeah. So, let's blow up these last two tanks. And get some money. I also went back through there. Got some money. I like how I said it's not a very good grinding spot, but I was using it for one for a little bit. And, oh my gosh, it's that guy! I thought we were rid of him after that cutscene. I dig and I dig and I'm still nowhere near the bottom! Well, jeez! That thing was on the ground! Way. That's a ruin! And now it's a tower! He's coming. Alright everyone, quit digging! Our priority now is to get rid of our little blue friend, alright? Good luck with be that, careful. sir. Don't be fooled by his size. He's already beaten Bon and Tron. Let's do it. Roger. Okay. So we jump down here and oh my gosh! That's a, that's a digging machine. So yeah, we have to destroy the Marl Wolf. That's what it's called. Mission start. And oh my gosh! All right. So what you're going to want to do at first is just shoot his wheels. Ignore what he said right there because he is wrong. Wrong, sir. You are wrong. And those birds you hear tweeting are actually flying bombs. Not sure they went... Ah, nah, nah. Not sure why they went with that sound effect, but they did. So, yeah. I think that I'm winning, sir. Okay. Oh, not the right place. Where I want to go is over here. And grab on with the hands that I don't have. Oh, no. He's about to fire. He's about to fire. Ah! Dang it. All right. Let's just take this thing out. Oh, that's a bomb. That's a bomb. That's a bomb. Oh, no. Okay. It's okay. All right. So what that did, shooting him, it slowed him down a lot. Oh, crap. Dang it. Well, I've never had that happen before. I can honestly say that. All right. Now let's get back up here. Oh, dang it. Thought I had it. Did he destroy? He destroyed my shield. That loser. That loser destroyed my shield. So yeah, this is what it looks like whenever you have, whenever your shield is gone forever until you talk to Data again. Or if you have a shield repair, uh, you could use that too. And I forgot to mention that I'm pretty sure whenever if you talk to Data before, oh, yes, I did it. Before you fight the pirates for the first time, you know how Data's outside of that door in the apple. Apple, Apple, the Apple Place, what's it called? <laughs> I, I think it's just called the Apple Market, oh my gosh, I'm s I don't even know. Alright, there! I, I actually did it that time. But you're supposed to get, well you're not exactly supposed to, it just makes it a lot easier if you jump on. What? You're kidding me! You are kidding me! Ha! Ah, I foresaw that attack. And it hit me still. Still hit me. Right. We have an energy canteen. I could use that. See? It pays to pay. Alright. Why can't I jump on that?
Now don't fall off! I hate this game. And, uh, of course, of course. is taking way longer than it should! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Alright, so if you see that guy come out with the bomb and you shoot him back and for some reason you move while on this. I guess I didn't just texture this very good. Oh my gosh! Thank you! So yeah, if you, if the bomb guy comes out, and you have the chance to, if the bomb guy comes out, hit him back, and then the, bl the bomb will blow up in there, and wow, I'm really surprised. <laughs> as soon as I finally get on there, oh my gosh, that, ah! as soon as I finally get on there, all three of them were the bomb guy. Most of the time, I get the little birdie bombs, and then I end up blowing them up, and then they knock me off. Although, I think the game finally decided I'd been knocked off way too much. Oh, that took way longer than it should have. I'm almost nine minutes into recording this. I love the way those guys run. And then he trips. Never noticed that before. I love the serve bots. Love the serve bots. Speaking of serve bots, I can't remember if I mentioned this in 1 through 4, but um, I'll link a Facebook uh, thing in the description. There's actually a group out there that is trying to revive uh, Mega Man Legends 3. And if you... Time to go home. If you like that group and then go on to the Capcom dev room and become a serve bot, the, it, that would be fantastic because the more supporters they have, the more likely Mega Man Legends 3 will be revived. And I still have not played Legends 2. Please don't ruin the ending for me. If you do, I swear I'm going to find you. But, um, yeah. Apparently it was left on a gigantic Mega cliffhanger. Man, and... I, I would love that game. I love the first game. Can't I wish there was a third one. So please. No, I will not. I wonder if something's wrong with this radio. I thought I just heard you say you're not going. Mega Man, you'll go see the mayor, right? Roger. No, oh, it doesn't even it doesn't even give me a choice next time. It's just Roger. No. No choice. If only we'd known there was someone like him here in the first place. We won't fail next time. We'll ambush. Concentrate our firepower on him. <laughs> we won't cut him any slack just because we outnumber him. That is going down. Just wait till you see, Diesel. I've got a new robot I've been wanting to build that'll do the trick. That'll teach him. Yeah, sure it will. Just like it taught me the first three times. And get that treasure! That's just so random. The, the thing just there, like, BOW! That was a terrible impersonation of a serve bot. Mega Man, good Why is he all the way over there now? You show those pirates I mean, I guess it's boss. not that important, but he's he was right next to her every other time, and then all of a sudden, He's right there, he's so just much. whoop over there. I hope this will convince those pirates to give up. Probably I'm not. To think what might happen if they get their hands on the treasure. They'll be rich. That's about it. Oh, maybe not. 
Well, that's just a legend. Even if that's just a myth. Lately, we've been detecting increased activity underground. The Reaver bots are apparently activating of their own accord. It has oh, me no. concerned. Maybe there's some truth to those stories about a horrible disaster. It's I possible, I guess. Mega Man. Would you be willing to explore the caves and dungeons on the island and see if you I... can find anything? Really? <laughs> no. I want to get out of here. What? And you call yourself a digger? How can you turn down an offer like that? Okay. You will? Oh, thank you. Okay. So Fine, I'll here, do it. Why can't these people solve their own freaking problems? Didn't we just get the Class B license? What was the point of that? Only the best diggers are able to get a Class A license. The best of the best. It's funny, because she doesn't even know how good of a digger I am. I just fought off some pirates, and she's like, Oh my gosh, you're amazing digger! Don't even... Don't know how that works. I mean, I guess she figures I can handle combat, and... Reaver bots underground, but she she just hasn't even seen my my abilities um, underground. I hate but to mention this, but whatever. If while you're digging you find anything of value, oh, it would mean a lot to us. Oh, that's what this was about. You just want me to get money for you. Oh, that's. I can't even look at you anymore. Can't even look. Get away from me. Alright, so now that we've destroyed the Marl Wolf and hopefully the pirates forever, probably not, I think I'm going to call this an episode. So next time, we will use our Class A license, most likely. Unless I decide to do something else. And then... We'll see if there's anything of value underground because that's all the mayor cares about. We'll see you guys next time.